Hello, and welcome to the Top Solid Modeling Tutorial Step 2, where we're going to learn how to create a drilling. Within this tutorial, we'll show you how to access the drilling command, how to position your drilling, and go over some of the various controls within the function. Let's see how it all works. Hi again, welcome back. Now we're going to progress to Step 2. I'm going to drag over my PDF document that was on my other screen and look at the next step in our design. In this case, we want to drill a hole through the part on our zero that's one and a quarter inches in diameter. Cool. Let's have a look. To do this is really easy. You can either go up to the drilling command under shape here and start that way, or you can just right mouse button click right on the top face of the model hill and choose drilling. Something really cool about top solid. When it sees circular objects, it wants to snap to the center of them automatically. That's awesome. Now, if you want to be sure that you're on the zero, zero, we could also reference our frame right here, absolute frame, and it's done. Okay. Now, just to show this again, you could go up to drilling and then go and select on the model. Again, the choice is yours. Now, in this case, all we want is an inch and a quarter diameter through hole. So I'm going to click on my standard hole. I'm going to come down here. If this is minimized on yours, just click on the button here to expand it. And I'm going to set this to inch and a quarter. Now here, that wheel cut through the model, but I'm also going to talk about good design intent practice. In this case, what I want to do is I don't want to leave this blind. I want to set the modeling condition as through. This way, if I go back and change the thickness of my part, the drilling will always cut through it properly. Perfect. Once you have that, validate and step two of this tutorial is complete. Great job.